msikiti wetu kwa kusema ukweli tumekuwa na shida sana ya maji. Lakini kusema ukweli tangu huu mradi uanze tumekuwa na furaha yenye isiyo hata tunaweza kuongelea. Kwa sababu tulikuwa tunatoa maji kule mtoni tunaleta hapa. Ili tupate kutawadha maji tulikuwa na shida ngumu sana mpaka tunabidi tunaajiri watoto wanakuja wanatuletea maji saa ingine tunawalipa kitu kidogo tumekuwa na shida sana kusema ukweli mkubwa wetu ametusaidia kazi kubwa sana kwa hii mradi wa maji imetusaidia sisi kama wamama tutaweza kuwa tuko na sherehe yote tunakosa maji tunaambia watoto kimbia mtoni sasa kwa ukweli maji imetusaidia hata sasa hivi tuko na fulaya kuhusu hiyo maji hatuwezi hata enda mahali hata kwa kudawadi tunasaidika tu tuko hapo karibu unakaa una, una dawadi na hii maji pia imesaidia watu wote wa hii area hii area ya Oyani tunashukuru sana na tunaambia tunaambia Fatuma asanti kwa yenye ametufanyia Mungu asidi kumuonekania na pia Mungu amrudishie kwa venye amefanya tunampongeza kwa kazi ambayo amefanya kuleta maji hapa msikitini ili isaidie kijiji nzima bali sio uh, msikiti peke yake. Kwa hivyo na muomba e, naona hapa kama msikiti ni iko mbali na pale chini. Kwa hivyo tungeomba kama ingeza kupigwa hapa iteremke pale chini pia isabu watu wa pale pale maduka oyani. Sasa watu wanakuja kuchota hivi karibu. Pande wetu sisi tumeshukuru kama Waislamu kwa sababu tikiwa na sherehe ama mwezi mtukufu Ramadhani kama hivi huwa inakuwa shida sana kama tuna maji. Maana sisi waislamu ni usafi, usafi ni maji. Kwa hivyo tumeshukuru sana kwa hao waheshimiwa ambao kwamba wametuletea maji. Sababu mwezi wa Ramadhani ni mwezi ambao kwamba unahitaji utulivu na unahitaji maji. Msikitu unaweza fungwa kama si maji. Sisi ni tofauti. Haya maji tunashukuru sana aliyeanza paka mwisho huu bila maji sisi tuwezi swali tutafunga msikiti tunashukuru women rep wetu kuweza kufight na kutufikishia haya maji hapa na tunaomba ya maji yatoke pia kwa walioko jirani zetu sisi uislamu siwezi wenda hapo choni bila maji siwezi enda msikitini bila maji kwa hivyo wanajua wao hata hiyo women rep ni muislamu na tunazidi kumuombea dua hazidi kutufanyia zaidi na zaidi tuweze kupata zaidi ya haya as a religious counselor as a Turkish Tianet foundation we did in migori this is second water well this borehole one approximately 150 meters and also it has nine solar panel and also it has 12 top this our borehole expense approximately 40000 USD as a Turkish Diyanet Foundation and also as a religious counselor especially I want to appreciate to honorable my sister Fatuma Muhammad because of this water we ask only dua about Turkey and also about Turkish people uh, I'm very grateful to the Turkish people for the honor they have done to bring for us a second water borehole in Migori County the first water borehole was done in Nyatike sub county again in Migori County the second one that they were supposed to do was unsuccessful because they dug and they didn't reach the water and so we abandoned the site and we came here and did a second one successfully. It's about uh, 5.2 million Kenya shillings. They do their things in dollars. Depending on the rate of exchange, approximately is about 5.2 million Kenya shillings. All this money came from their pocket and none came from our government. It's all from the Turkish government. We were really suffering in terms of water, not only for the mosque, but also for the people around here and the general public. We want to say thank you. We are looking uh, for more partnership, not only getting from Turkey, also get Turkey should also be benefiting from us in terms of other sectors, agriculture and other sectors, uh, the clothing and all that, so that we can all grow as a population and, uh, and humanity.